Hello everybody and welcome back to the Danish Woodsman. At the time recording this video it is a bit rainy so if that comes across in the audio I do apologize but if you are a long term watcher of this channel you are probably used to the not that great sound quality. So anyway let's continue with the update of what models the Park River are going to release in the near future. Let's take a look at the first model. All the time being it looks like Bark River are actually straying away from producing a lot of their EDC or smaller models and are actually going to release true two really really classic blades in the near future. Um, the first of them are a very anticipated knife by many and at least by me because that is the Mini Kephardt. And the Kephardt is obviously, obviously one of the most iconic uh, knife designs of all time, designed by um, Horace Kephardt who are said to be um, the father of the American bushcraft movement. Um, and this is Bark Rivers scaled down reincarnations of a reincarnation of his knife design. So they are doing a full size cap out and this is the scaled down version. So you end up with a knife with an overall length of 19.1 centimeters, a blade length of 9.2 centimeters and a very thin spine of only 2.4 millimeters um, with the classic cap heart spear point design and this one will be produced in the super tough and durable 3V steel. So um, as I said, this is one of the most, uh, most iconic and classic, classic blades produced by Bark River in a scaled down version. Um, but it is still big enough for you to have a full four finger grip on it according to Mike Stewart. He actually said that anything you can do with the big cap out, you can do with the smaller one. It's just a lighter package. That was the first one that Bark River are going to release. Let's take a look at the next one. Blade that Bark River are currently producing and will be released in the near future is actually a blade that we haven't seen in a very very long time. It's, uh, it is the Man Mani Tour. I probably butchered that 100%. I'm sorry, I do not know how to pronounce it, but it is one of the super classic uh, utility hunting blades. Most of them will probably be seen with the stacked leather handle, um, but a super classic. Um, and stylish hunting and utility blade with a overall length of 23.8 centimeters, a blade length of 11.6 centimeters, and produced in the super durable and um, very popular crew wear steel. Um, so, that was the two blades the Bark River are going to release in the near future. Let's just quickly talk about them. The reason why you should be interested in either one of these blades um, is actually pretty similar because they are both hunting and utility focused classic blades. So if you're in the market for a super slicey blade, a small package with a really thin spine that can do a lot of slicing, you should definitely look into the cap heart. It's obviously designed to do all sorts of chores in the wilderness, so everything from food prep to uh, general camp chores. It will really really excellent. Um, the Mantuni Mani Tour, as I said, is a classic utility hunting knife, so if you like the classic look and um, are um, considering to get yourself a new hunting knife um, to the upcoming season, you should definitely look into that. This has been the Danish Watchman and I hope the sound hasn't been too bad. Um, and if you enjoyed the content, make sure, make sure to subscribe. I do these update videos on Black River every week along with uh, some other content primarily focused around knives um, and I'm hoping to see you guys in the next one. Peace out.